Hi guys, good morning. I hope you're all doing well. I am starting another very chilled, relaxed weekend vlog. I know you guys enjoy these type of videos where I show you what I'm up to. And actually this weekend I have a few interesting things and events to go to. So I thought it would be fun to vlog and show you what I'm up to this weekend. Starting from today, today is actually Friday. It's not the weekend yet, but I count it as the weekend it's it's the end of the week it feels like a weekend already <laughs> i have actually organized a very special dinner so <laughs> i'm getting ready and i will take you with me vlog a little bit not the whole thing because it's quite private but um I'll take you with me anyway and I wanted to do a quick get ready with me, decide what I'm going to wear. I have an idea what I want to wear. We are going to a steakhouse in Richmond. It's one of my favorites and I love Richmond. It's such a beautiful area by the river. So yeah, I'm gonna take you with me and show you what I'm up to tonight. But I wanted to do a quick get ready with me. I'm going to do my eyes quickly. For the eyebrows, I recently discovered this product. Bianca actually told me about this product. It's very strong hold. You can even use it on your hair for like hair edges, but it's good for eyebrows as well. So just setting my eyebrows and they don't move so i'm gonna use this brush has two sides from chanel and actually i might use a bronzer so i'm gonna use the nars laguna and then i have this nars palette i'm gonna use this and mix it with this I'll just apply the same on the lower lash line. And then I'm also going to use this more golden one. I have these very sparkly mono eyeshadows from Dior. Mine are so messy, I've had them for a while, but I like to use them in the inner corner to open up the eye. I'm going to use this Valentino palette and then with this angle brush I will just do a soft brown eyeliner. This is by the way one of my favorite everyday palettes but it's also good for an evening out. You can definitely um, do a very smoky intense eye makeup but you can also create a very soft look. I will link this case down below. I store all my eyelashes in here. For lipstick, I'm going to apply this one. It's from NARS in the color London. Let's see. Yeah, it looks good with these eyeshadows now. And done. Fragrance of the day, Jasmine Rouge by Tom Ford. It is so good, especially for date nights, evening out. So yeah, highly recommend. And I love wearing it, especially in fall and winter. And these, oh, I have to talk about these. I actually already put them on. <laughs> but these are the best tights ever. I'm going to link them down below. Just bear in mind, they run small, so size up. I'm usually small or medium in tights. These I had to size up, so I got a large. But guys, they are the best. They have the tummy compression. They suck you in. Oh, they're so good and they're very durable as well. So if you're looking for really good quality tights that suck you in, lift your bum up, try these, they're amazing. Special evening, so Louis is coming out. <laughs> For shoes, I'm gonna wear my mesh Louboutins. All right, guys, that's the final look. What do we think? Let me know in the comments. Louis, Louis bag, Louis earrings. 
my Jonah brown coat from El Cupini. I have a discount coat for it. And yeah, this is tonight's date or OTD. It's a bit early actually, but I wanted to get ready so you can see the final look before it gets dark. <laughs> I still have a couple of more hours to kill. So yeah, I'll see you later at dinner. Details again. Hi guys, another day, another outfit and I have an event today, that's why I'm all glommed up. I'm wearing one of my favourite Zimmerman dresses. I have an event with a brand so I'll take you with me and the event will be in the private room. So I have taken you to Bacchanalia before but I haven't shown you the private room so... Yeah, we're going there tonight and I actually wanted to, before I go, show you a few dresses that I got recently and two of them, yeah, two of them, I have four dresses, two of them almost identical to this one because I know you ask about this dress and unfortunately it is old collection. I will see if Zimmerman has something similar currently if you want a Zimmerman dress because this is Zimmerman but I will show you some high street options that are so affordable. I think most of the dresses are about £50 and they look pretty much the same so let me grab them so this is the first one and it has the same design it is a wrap around dress this one wraps as well and it is in a black satin also i got this one in a medium i would say it runs true to size so go with your normal size it is on the shorter side it opens up on the front a little bit, but if you're wearing black tights, I mean, you're pretty safe. <laughs> Actually, I don't know, maybe it's the same length as the Zimmerman one, but yeah, exactly the same cut, much cheaper, much more affordable, and it is black, just classic black. I'm definitely keeping this one. I will keep all four dresses that I'm about to show you, although they're pretty similar. I think this style, this... Um, cut of dresses really suits me as well they're very flattering because they are quite cinched in the waist next i have this one another very similar dress it has the ruffles at the bottom falls the same way wraps around the exact same way it has shoulder pads this one so it looks a bit more structured on the shoulders but it is also a similar color so yeah, maybe this one actually is the closest one to the zimmerman it has the uh, long sleeves and they have elastics at the end so you can actually uh, scrunch them up. My Zimmerman dress is the same, you can pull the sleeves up, it has the elastics. Um, but yeah, this is the one that's the most similar and it's actually probably the cheapest. It was a $35.99. And you know what's so great about all these dresses that I'm showing you? They all work for both spring, summer, for winter, basically all seasons, because you can wear them with tights as well, because they're darker colours. This next one looks like a Himalayan croc. Can you guys see? The print is so stunning, isn't it? This one, as you can see, is not a wraparound. It has elasticated waist. And for reference, by the way, I'm 170 centimeters, so they do, all these dresses do look a bit short on me. But as I said, I bought them to wear in fall and winter with tights mainly anyway so I think they'll look really really cute. This one was $45.99 again it has the elastics on the sleeves so you can uh, scrunch them up it has the cute little ruffles and yeah I love the fabric very very lightweight the print is so beautiful I love the print this croc Himalayan croc is stunning. This however is my favorite I think Again, let me know in the comments which one was a favorite, but this, oh, I love this dress so much. It's classic polka dot. Polka dot is very, very timeless, but also it has, I'll show you an up close, this like golden 
thread so it's perfect it's an evening dress i love the mesh sleeves also the high neck and the top bit is quite see-through uh, but the bottom is double lined it's almost like a pleated detailing on the chest and the waist as well so it's very flattering also the skirt at the bottom is very flattering it's such a nice cut and this one is 49.99 see all dresses under 50 pounds and they do look quite similar um, so yeah, I want to show you some options and these are the new ones that I added to my faux wardrobe So I wanted to show you if you're going to any events All these dresses I think work perfectly But let me show you tonight's outfit in the mirror before I go Ooh, also wanted to show you the earrings I'm wearing are from Ido and they're the modular diamond earrings so these and also can you guys see this chain it is so beautiful here is an up close bag of the night can you guess sparkly sparkly okay guys this is the final look what do we think the bag works so well with the dress and the shoes I'm wearing. My Chanel sling bags from pre-spring summer collection 2023. Love them. And look how well they go with the bag. So yeah, final look, ready to go. Let's go to Bacchanalia. Hi guys, a quick intro. I am going to the hairdressers. I'm wearing something very, very sporty. So I wanted to show just a pair of Adidas leggings. Bright pink sneakers. One of my favorite El Copini coats in navy blue and to match I'm wearing my 30 Montaigne dual bag. Yeah, as I said, I'm going to the hairdressers. I desperately need a haircut. My hair is way too long and it looks very weak. So yeah, I need to cut quite a bit of it. I'll probably grab breakfast and coffee on the way because I don't want to be late for my appointment. And I'll talk to you later in the day and let you know what I'm up to. But let's go cut my hair. <laughs> Another look of my outfit. I like to be sporty when I go to the hairdresser. <laughs> Hi again, I'm back home and I styled my hair. 
Is it just me? After the hairdresser's appointment, I always like to do my hair at home, style it the way I like it. I don't really let them curl my hair at the salon. I just let them roughly blow dry it and that's it pretty much. <laughs> but yeah, I styled it myself, curled it the way I like it, soft curls. And I think my hair looks much healthier now. They cut actually quite a lot of hair. It was down to hair <laughs> and they cut quite a lot but it looks so much healthier now so yeah i'm happy with the haircut it's much shorter <laughs> than i thought but i'm happy it looks cool so i decided to come back home change grab something to eat because i'm starving although i ate a little pastry earlier you might have seen i vlogged a little bit so i grabbed something quick on the way to the hair salon but i'm still quite hungry it's quite late in the afternoon plus i wanted to change and i was expecting a delivery which arrived <laughs> it is here this is my believe it or not my first ever beauty advent calendar and I'm so excited to unbox it and see all the products inside. I think there are some lipsticks inside and a lip liner, lip gloss. So I really wanted to try them on and see the colors as well. So I'm going to do that with you. I also decided to come back home and change because I have another date night later on. And I really wanted to go get my nails done because they look... Can you see? Oh, it's not focusing. They look horrible. <laughs> so yeah, that's the plan pretty much for the rest of the day. Nails. I'm going to show you the advent calendar and later on have cocktails. It's actually at a place I've been wanting to go to. I saw it on uh, TikTok and I was like, oh, this place looks so cool. It's so much fun. The cocktails are so unique. So I'm going to vlog a little bit and show you. Um, but yeah, that's the plan pretty much. Let's start with the advent calendar shall we and i'm gonna show you my outfit later as well okay here it is the best advent calendar that i found this year when i say the best guys i mean it all the products inside are so wearable and the sizes are great as well you will see usually i have never bought a beauty advent calendar because usually brands include a lot of rubbish inside like free gifts that they normally give when you purchase something little samples or stickers or sometimes i've seen dior includes um the little stars that they put the metal stars that they put on the paper bags normally when you when you shop from a boutique and to me that's like so useless i don't need that i already have that and yeah, it's usually products that i don't want or shades like lipsticks in colors that i would never wear they usually put red shades inside the advent calendars i know it's like christmas but still i would rather buy a nude lipstick or like a shade that i would actually wear uh, i already have quite a few red lipsticks and i don't need any more reds <laughs> so when i saw this advent calendar i had a quick look i saw all the products and i was like i will actually use all of these and some of them i already have and i love and i wanted to repurchase it just arrived so i actually haven't even looked properly but i love the packaging first of all it's like a little vanity you can use it as a storage later on and i love these little handles with crystals how cute i think it will be easier this way now if i show you actually i can't do this with one hand never mind <laughs> okay so let's see what's in the first one it is a lip gloss i think and look at the shades, how nice. I will actually try this on and insert a clip. You know, I actually watched a few unboxings of this advent calendar here on YouTube. Nobody showed how these shades look on, so I'll do that for you if you're interested. Let's see the next one. Oh, this is a product I have been actually wanting to try. It is the Magic Serum. Right, the next one. I love this. I love this product so much and actually my one is finishing so perfect timing. This is the highlighting wand and I actually love this color. It's in the color spotlight. It's beautiful golden shade. Next one. This. I'm so excited about this. I've been wanting to try this lip oil for such a long time. So I definitely use this as a lip night mask. My lips are always cracked and it has a roller. Next one is... 
a little mascara. I've never tried the Charlotte Tilbury mascaras. And look, the size is not bad. This will be great for traveling as well. Next one. I love Charlotte Tilbury lip liners. This is in the shade Hot Gossip. It's neutral and it will match the lip gloss. See, that's what I mean. All the colors, the shades complement each other. The lip gloss, the lip liner. There is a lipstick as well. Let's find the lipstick. Ooh, this is the Rock & Co Iconic Liquid Eye Pencil in the color Barbella Brown. See, I actually wanted to get a brown eyeliner. I find black eyeliner quite harsh under the eye in the waterline. Plus, I started actually wearing softer brown eyeliner um, as well. So this will be great. This is exactly what I needed. One of my favorites. I have this brush already. This is the brush that I used to apply my foundation. I actually bought it a while ago. This is a mini size. The regular size is actually the same, <laughs> maybe slightly bigger and it is dual ended. So it has another brush on the other side. But yeah, it's a really good brush. So if you're looking for a new foundation brush, highly recommend it. Another draw. Ooh, check this out. Look at the packaging. <gasps> Do you see why this is the best advent calendar? All the shades complement each other and I can wear them together. Lip liner, lipstick, lip gloss on top. Can't wait to try this combo. <laughs> Ooh, yes, another product that I have been wanting to try. This is the blush, matte beauty blush wand. And this is in the color... Pillow talk, amazing. Almost at the end now. Oh, I love this. The magic cream. I'm sure you've heard of Charlotte Tilbury's magic cream. Everyone loves it, everyone I know loves it. I haven't personally tried it, but you have no idea how excited I am to try this face cream. Apparently it's amazing. Ooh, smells so good. Definitely gonna try this tonight before bed. And who's excited for the last draw? We have, I have this product and I love this product. It is the setting spray, airbrush setting spray. Another favorite product. Let me actually spray some. So good and so refreshing, love it. And it's empty. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna have another coffee at home, probably something quick to eat, and I'm gonna go get my nails done. I'll show you my outfit before I go as well. Okay guys, just wanted to show you tonight's outfit before I leave. I'm wearing the Chanel Pearl Clutch from Metier Dard. I'll link my unboxing above in case you've missed it. This new dress is from Lily Silk and it's from their latest collection. And this is the final look from a distance. So you can see sparkly Chanel boots, a long Lily Silk dress. I had to put on a coat because later on it will get really, really chilly and the dress is not very thick. So I think this looks really good for an evening out, sparkly boots. <laughs> I don't know, I hope I'm not too dressed up for the place. I looked it up online, but yeah, the presentation of the cocktails looks so unique and I'm very excited. The place looks amazing, so I'll take you with me. But before that, I need to sort these nails out. So <laughs> let's go get my nails done. And after that, we're heading for cocktails. <laughs> oh, and I'm also wearing the new lip combo from Charlotte Tilbury as well. <laughs> 